swing in circles. I, I can't seem to get my arm to go in circle. <laughs> I'm yeah. not coordinated there you enough go. to do that. Uh. Yeah, but I'm using my arm to do it, not my body. <laughs> and I'm not supposed to use my arm. I'm supposed to just use my body. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> it started out to be another bad night. It really did. I was posted the, what did we call it? A day in the car? Yeah. A day in the car uh, vlog. I stayed up and posted that. And I started uploading the shout outs. And I was going to wait to make sure I could post that. So I started moving files all around. And Kevin woke up at some point. It was after three. I woke up? Yeah. I guess I kind of woke up. Yeah, Because kinda. I don't remember it. And I said, it's still not done. And he's like, just hit publish and go to bed. <laughs> so. That sounds like me. I said, are you sure it's going to work? Because it didn't work like that the other day, remember? It did not work like that the just other day. Just go to bed, though. I mean, if it didn't work, we'll do it the next day. Don't like doing that. But you, you stay up all night long. Yes. Because our subscribers want our stuff. <laughs> <laughs> our sub By the way, has anybody seen Kevin yet? <laughs> Shh. <laughs> Just went for a greasy taco. <laughs> <laughs> That hurt. No laughing while you're swinging there. It wasn't laugh because of the laugh. It was because of the cough. Okay. <coughs> I'm still coughing and it hurts. So, and me being the in person, blah, blah, me being the impatient person that I am, I get my stitches out yesterday. I... The Walking Dead is here. Hey, right. Norman's here. Let me go get your cardboard, Norman. <laughs> I was getting undressed and being the unpatient person that I am. Impatient. Impatient person that I am. I could not wait for Kevin to help me. Of course not. So I tried to get undressed and put on my nightshirt by myself. And what do I do? I hurt my arm. Of course you do. Of course I do. <clears throat> you just waited for me. You took too long. <laughs> and this guy this morning scared me. Yeah, and you scared me. I'm feeding him this morning, and he's standing there, and then he starts walking in a circle with his one leg up like he just hurt himself, and he goes right over like he was having a heart attack or something, and gave me these big brown puppy eyes and freaked me out, Then he got up and walked away. He didn't get up and walk away. Kevin calls me. I'm on the toilet. <laughs> I come flying out because he tells me something wrong with freckles. And I come out, Freckles is standing there eating, and he's done eating. I said, Freckles, you got to go potty? And he runs to the door. <laughs> there was nothing wrong with him. He's quite an actor, aren't you? Okay, so it's a really beautiful day here in California. It's uh, 93 degrees, which is killing Val. She went back to bed, but I love it. So, I love being out here. It's beautiful. You can see the mountains, happy birds. It's got a breeze. It looks really nice. Today, however, I have to do laundry. So I got that started. I'm cleaning up the house a little because it's become 
bit of a pig sty and uh, just let Val sleep and enjoy the uh, my garage and the great outdoors. It was 93 earlier. It's probably a little hotter now, uh, which means there's nobody outside. Except me, of course. I'm the crazy one. I have some errands to run. Val's asleep. Um, I have some books I want to, uh, to give to Goodwill. I tried selling them on eBay, but nobody seems to be interested, so uh, they're taking up space, So, and I can't throw things like that away. So, Goodwill I go to. I've got some clothes I'm also going to take there. Have some aluminum that's been sitting around forever. I've decided to cash the aluminum in. Gets it out of the house and gives me a couple of bucks in the pocket. And then I have to go to the store because we ran out of milk and such. And that is my day. I, I did a lot of cleaning up today. I did some laundry. And that's pretty much it. Well, it doesn't look like I'm getting rid of the aluminum today. I must have left too late. They closed at 4. Or at least, you could tell he was supposed to close at 4. I got there about 10 minutes till and he wasn't going to do anything. He was ready to go. So, I'm on my way to the grocery store. So, Boomer. Boomer. You've been getting a little rough with Daddy, huh? Look at this, everybody. Boomer plays rough. Um, Boomer, <laughs> Boomer, Boomer, your fur is getting in the way. Look at Kevin's arm, everybody. <laughs> See all those marks? Keep your arm still. See all those marks up here? There's one, too. There's more underneath, too. Uh, not so bad underneath. Boom. Boomer. Hi! <laughs> yes, you are such a little character. Hey everybody, I want to give a great big thank you to Tessa from the Milm Life. She is actually a wonderful person. She's running a campaign for anti-abuse. And I just want to give you guys a quick little peek. There is the beginning of the campaign and it shows Face of a Survivor, Help Stop Abuse. And here's just a quick little campaign that she's running. Hope everyone's having a good day. Um, I told everybody that I was going to be starting a shirt campaign to help raise awareness on different forms of abuse. And the campaign is now launched. I will leave the link below so that you guys can check it out. Um, there are shirts, and the shirts say, Face of a Survivor, Help Stop Abuse. Here's, here's the, the picture of the, the shirt. It's a purple shirt, and purple is actually the color for anti-abuse. So, if everybody can please go over and help support her campaign, we'll leave a link to the campaign down below, as well as a link to her channel. She's a wonderful person, and um, we know of several people who have been through abusive relationships and um, can really, really, you know, use the support and the ear of other people that have gone through it to to lean on so great job Tessa love ya Boomer. Um. Boomer. Boomer. hey Boomer hi hi Boomer hi Boomer it's all scratched its chin oh scratchy scratchy can I get the foot going can I get the foot going what are you two doing are you trying to kill Daddy? They're trying to trip me. I guess they figure if they trip me, I might drop something out of them. Right? Is that true? Look. Whoa. Hey guys, I hope you guys all enjoyed hanging out with Kevin today. Well, I was a little busy. Sleeping. Relaxing. <laughs> In the air conditioning. But hey Jess, Kevin oh, has accepted oh, oh, the challenge. Oh, it's on. It's on like Donkey Kong. <laughs> I hope you guys give this video a it's, big thumbs up. It's on like the movie Tron. Hit <laughs> the little red subscribe button. It's on like Genghis Khan. Down below if you haven't already subscribed. It's on like the Pentagon. And share this video.
Sophia with your friends and family. It's on like James Caan. Who knows? They may find us a little crazy as well. It's on like Grape Poop Pond. Shut up already!